Wearing their favorite team's jerseys, a small group of dogs and dog lovers used the Super Bowl as an excuse to hold one of their many social events benefiting stray animals in the Glen Cove area. Hi, my name is Heather Lehrman, and this is my Boston Terrier puppy. He turns two today, named Herbie. We're here today because I am running the Long Island Smush Face Group, and we're having a special doggy meetup today. Petco is sponsoring us, and they're very wonderful to have us here today. At every meetup that we've done at Petco, we do a special donation to the local shelter called the Glen Cove Animal Lovers League. And what happens is every dog and owner gets a professional photo taken by the manager here, Bobby, who's wonderful. We have a room back there set up for photos and they get to take home a framed photo of their dog. And then they could donate a few dollars to the Lovers League and it goes to the local shelter to help them out. I am actually the owner of the franchise of in-home pet services of the North, North Shore. It's called the Gold Coast Location from Manhasset to Glen Cove area. We are a pet sitting and dog walking franchise. We currently have eight locations throughout Brooklyn, Queens and Nassau. And hopefully if we find the right person, we'll be expanding out to Suffolk County this year. We incorporated the Smush Face Group into the company so that everybody gets to bring their dogs and they're our clients and they're our friends and they're everybody that the company is involved with and we get to meet other people on Long Island. We do a lot of events at in-home pet services throughout the year. You know, we've really grown to a point that I couldn't have dreamed of when we started 10 years ago, which means we really can make a significant impact in our community through fundraising, um, pet education, to be able to improve the lives of pets and really to help other groups like rescue groups with their missions as well. While the fundraising is an important part of what the group does, the meetups are beneficial to both the dogs and their owners. I think the benefits are great because a lot of people when they come to meetups like this that are sort of breed specific in that they are Boston Terriers, French Bulldogs, um, anything like that, they get to learn from each other, the owners, about all different kinds of things that the dogs might have as uh, behavioral characteristics or health issues. They really get to learn from each other and they all become friends and the dogs look forward to seeing each other. It's really cute when they haven't seen each other in a while and then they greet each other all excited like a little kid to see each other. I actually have members in this group that have never socialized their dog and they've come for the first time and they were petrified to even put their dog in the group and their dog got along so well with others they were shocked and they come every month now and it gives them the benefit of exercise, friendship, the owners become friends, everybody has a wonderful time with the meetups and it, my group has grown from the first original member, Herbie, to 90 members. So you could just tell that this group is something very special. This is Cosmo. He's five months old. He's a mini French bulldog. He's actually the newest member of the Smush group. Um, we came here, I guess it was Christmas, and we were here for training, and we saw the group, and we decided to stay because this little guy, who actually doesn't realize that he has a smush face, started seeing all these other puppies who look like him and I think he got so excited so we decided to stay and he loved it and here we are again. With the generous support of Petco, small groups like these are making a significant impact on the lives of stray animals across the country. With Think Adoption First what we try to do is always encourage people to adopt animals even if it drives you away from buying from our own stores. With Think Adoption First, we raise money for our partners, for Glen Cove, that's the Glen Cove Animal Lovers League. And nationwide, what we've done is we've raised over $100 million for stray animals since 1999. This group gives me so much satisfaction. I don't get paid to do this. I love doing it. It is just amazing to see these dogs so happy. I just love watching the dogs playing and being happy and the owners are just laughing and having a great time and they can't wait for the next meetup. For Push Paws in Glen Cove, this is Eric Alfredo.